I want to tell you something. Best people I ever had in my life was the judge and his son and his guest. Everybody was fantastic. I don't know how to, I'm speechless. I'm really speechless. A few years ago, I had the honor of presiding over a case that involved a 96-year-old motorist who was caught speeding while taking his 67-year-old son to the doctor. Mr. Kowawa, you are charged with a school zone violation. I don't drive that fast, Judge. I'm 96 years old and I drive slowly and I only drive when I have to. I was going to the blood work for my boy. He's handicapped. The clip went viral, getting over 400 million views worldwide. We followed the case up by visiting Victor in his home where he made for us the best apple pie I have ever tasted. Great. It is really good. I vowed to get the recipe from him, and today is the day. Hello, Victor. Yes, Judge. How old are you now? 99. You know, we first met when you came to court, and you told about your son, who was then, what, 67 back then? Yeah. And you mentioned that he was being treated for cancer, and you were taking him to the doctor. Yeah. So I want to ask, how is your son doing? He's coming along pretty good. He has his good days and bad days, but uh, he's doing them very, very good. We were just talking about your son. Now, I know what it is to have family, and I know what it is to worry about your sons. I have four of them. And as a matter of fact, one of them is here today, who you know, my son David. Yeah, David? I know David. He How are you doing, me. Victor? Very, very good. It's great to see you again. Nice to Wonderful see you, too. To see you. And now, the magical moment has arrived. We are going to make an apple pie with Victor Coella's recipe, and he's going to guide us through every single aspect of this. So Victor, we're ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's if go. You are. What's the first thing I do? First thing you do, you gotta put that in a plate. So you want me to place the dough yeah. in the plate? Okay, so I, I finished my job. Okay. Now, next step is what, Victor? You put the apples in, inside there. How many apple pies would you say you've made in your lifetime, Victor? Oh, it's hard to say. I, may, I average one every two weeks. Wow, that's 26 I, a year. Wow. Now, what is the next step? Put the sugar in. Okay. Okay, Victor, show us how to do it. I do it by hand. Yeah, how okay. much sugar is that, Victor? Three quarters of a, a cup. A cup. Okay. Okay. I got a spoon. I stir it. Okay, David's going to stir it. What's next, Victor? Then I I use the salt. I do everything by hand. Same thing. Okay. What's next? So you got the butter. <laughs> the old-fashioned spoon, right there, Victor. Beautiful. Okay. We'll mix that butter in, and it'll distribute as we go along. Then I put the lemon juice in. All right. How much lemon juice do you think? One tablespoon. All right, what's next? Then I put the cinnamon. The season in there. All right. So you got cinnamon. So a, a light coating of the apples. Right. You get the hang of it after you make four or 500 pies, right, Victor? Right. OK. Then I used the nutmeg. Oh boy, that aroma. You can really get it coming out now, Victor. And now, the coup de gras. What do we have here? Now this is a Grand Marnier. All right, how much of that do you put in? Well, I use it about a little more than a tablespoon. Oh, that's a, okay. That was, that was a little bit more that than a That was a little more than a tablespoon. <laughs> then you gotta put this in the bowl. Pour that into the bowl, okay. Oh, look at that, look at that. Now, does it have the look of a Victor Colella apple pie yet? It looks it's like It's getting there, okay. Do your magic, Victor, do your magic. I'm gonna help you down this end, Vic. Good. How's he doing? 
You do it better than I do. No, no, no. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just following the master. No, no, you did, you're doing a good, Judge. You're just trying to get a break on your next speeding ticket. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to say, Judge, I don't drive anymore. <laughs> okay, my next step is you get the butter. Okay, we have some more butter for you. And I use the old-fashioned way of fingers. This browns it a little. Mm -hmm. You don't put it on the edge. Okay, and next? Then I use the milk. Okay, we have some milk. A spoon. You want a brush or a spoon? The brush. Okay. You never go on, on the edge. Then my next step is I cut it to give it the air. And now we're, we're ready, Victor, to place this in the oven. So right. Any special instructions about placing it in the oven? What should the temperature be? What do we do? You put it in the oven yep. at 425 and for 40, 40 minutes. And I will place this on this grate. I think we may have set a world's record for the best apple pie for anyone 99 or younger, right? And Victor, I can't tell you how anxious we are to help you celebrate your 100th birthday. We're gonna do something special. I don't know what it is, but we definitely have to do something special. What do you, what do you think? You know something? I'm 99 years old, and I'm gonna make you the best lasagna you ever tasted. I can't wait. I hope your birthday was tomorrow. All right, Victor, it's been 40 minutes. And wow. Look at that. Wow, look at that. Victor. How's Victor, it? what do you think? How's it look? It looks good. Now, I don't know how it's going to taste. So, Victor, how long do you said mentioned earlier we have to let it rest? How long do we rest? About 10 minutes. Okay. If you had any advice to give young people, Victor, what would you say to them? First thing I would tell them, don't argue with anybody. That's the first thing. Because when you get tension, that's when you get nervous and you're no good. Eat three meals a day and listen to your mother and father. Victor, I'll I'm, second that. I'm with him every single day, every day. God bless you, and, yeah. And he reminds me every day I should pay attention to what he says. <laughs> You're right. You're it's right. true, it's true. The magic moment has arrived. Be honest. got just enough cinnamon, just enough Grand Marnier. The apples are nice and sweet. This is just perfect. The blend of what you did fit perfectly. Flavor is there, it's delicious. Victor's apple pie. Very tasty. Fit for a king. Well, I hope so. I hope everything come out all right. But you help me a lot, Judge. I tell you, God bless you. And I hope you live to be a hundred and ten years old. Oh, I'm... thank you, thank you. Yeah, Victor, Victor, you are. God bless you. You are an inspiration to everyone that's watching this and everyone that knows about you. You're just an inspiration.